Alright, hello people. I'm the dude and this is Let's Play Age of Wonders. To load her up. As you'll probably remember, we destroyed Arctica. She is gone for good. She has no chance to come back. Arctica is done like Din Din. So let's see. We're probably going to just pillage her area a bit. Since there's so many towns that are uh, free now. That aren't controlled by anyone. And so many groups of enemies that are basically just wandering like that one right there we could probably get them on our team if we talk to them yeah see and we'll take over her structures and stuff like that we'll make uh, plans to take out meander first I need to figure out what I need to migrate what is left to migrate that is priority number one okay we got a free frostling town right there so that's done actually let's get my list of races now that I think about it Let's see, okay, Archons, we definitely have Archons, we've been building Charioteers, they're right there. We have Elves. Uh, do we have Dwarves? Pretty sure we have Dwarves somewhere, right? What is this town? That's not even ours anymore. We gave that away, that's right, okay. What is this? This is Humans, I think. Yeah, okay, Humans... Tigrin. Did we not migrate dwarves? Am I that retarded? Oh my god. We didn't migrate dwarves. I had a dwarf town from like the start of the game, but I never migrated them. I forgot, I guess. Ugh, that is exceptionally stupid. Okay, so we need to take the town back. It was way over here somewhere. What the hell? Someone's burning down the dwarf town. Why? Why are you burning down the dwarf town? Don't... Don't burn down the dwarf town. I want it back. Can I buy it back? Please do not burn it down. I have no idea if there's another one. It's called Lab Dubar. Oh, I can't. Okay, give me the town back. Won't be happy. Okay, fine. I'll make him happy. Just don't burn down the damn town, please. Uh... We'll just keep him money. I've got tons of money. I have a bunch of money. Let's see. It's not moving very quickly. There we go. There's whatever that is. Are you happy now? There, he's happy. Okay, good. Don't burn down the town, please. Jesus. Ugh. It's got the little burning down animation, but it's not being raised. It's weird. I don't know. I don't care. Just build a unit to sit on the town for now. Because I need this town. I forgot to migrate dwarves because I'm retarded. I have brain damage apparently. Let's see. What else did I forget? Halfling Sauron. There's halflings right there and there's Sauron's right there. Human I obviously have. Tigran, Draconian, Frostling, Nomad. I have all those. Goblin I just got last video for free. Orc, Dark Elf, I have Dark Elf down here somewhere, right? They should be migrating. Shadow Demons. Undead, Dark Elf. Where is... It? Okay, Undead's right here? Yeah, and Dark Elf. Maybe Dark Elf's up here. Yeah, okay. Alright, so Dwarf is the only thing that I didn't have. <clears throat> Apparently. And the only ones I need to migrate are Dwarf and Goblin, I think. Right? Everything else is in my area. I believe. Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay, so the only ones I need to migrate are Dwarf and Goblin. So let's say that's a Dwarf or Goblin right there, and then that can be the other one. So why do I have this town over here? Why? I have no idea why I built that one. I, I counted wrong, I guess. I'll have an extra town, I suppose. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, you guys, what are you guys doing? You're... Okay, you're enforcing migration. Next turn, they can move over there. And we can migrate someone. Do I, do I have anyone headed this way at all? No. Okay, you guys go that way. Please. Good sirs. Go that way. Good, good. Okay, so I should have migration handled. Uh, why am I casting a Minotaur? I've already beaten Arctica. I don't need a Minotaur. I need Haste Domain. That's what I need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that. Do that. Do not need a Minotaur. 
Uh, yes, I got Lab Deburr. I'll give it back to him again. This will be the second time I've bought it and given it back to them, but, uh, I need to migrate the dwarves. I forgot. I forgot to migrate the dwarves, sadly. Where the hell is this? Who owns this town? Nobody. It's independent. Okay, we'll go buy it, I guess. What is that? First of all, let's investigate over here. Oh, there's a free item just lying on the ground. What is it? Pixie Dust? <laughs> Uh, Pixie Dust is like Cosmic Spray, it's just a random debuff. You can use it in battle and it'll give them like Burn or Poison or Curse or Vertigo or some random negative debuff. Not the best item in the world, but oh well. We'll talk to them next turn. Buy out their town from them. You need to go right there, actually. Take that from him, yes. Give me that. And then take that, and then take that, and then probably take some other stuff. <sighs> you are my pillaging bird of prey, stealing all their stuffages. Uh, you guys can actually join me for all I care. Is that an elephant rider? I think it is. Yeah, okay. Group up. Oh, that'll work. I was gonna move back anyways. There we go. You guys need to... Do I have any more? Yeah, I do. I have more charioteers. Okay, go down that way. And then you guys go up to meet them. And we'll have them all in a big... Nice little party. Should probably talk to these guys and try to recruit them. Seeing as they're rolling around my area right now. If I don't recruit them, seeing as they're independent, they'll take over towns at random and... Take over structures and stuff like that. I don't want that to happen. That's actually pretty cheap. Jesus. Wavern Rider, two Elephant Riders, two Knights. That's really cheap. We're going to hire them. Yes, yes. And I think we'll try and spread them around a bit. Because... Nah, screw it. We'll keep this party together. Whatever. You guys can go this way and see what's going on over here. Let's see. You need to go this way and talk to this town. And you can probably grow up with them, I guess. That'll work. Uh, you're still migrating, you're defending. I don't need both parties here, so this other party can go do some. What is in this party? I have no idea. Whole bunch of Zephyr birds. Okay, no, they're not done. I didn't mean to click that. Okay, we're gonna use these Zephyr Birds to scout. Because that's pretty much all they're good for. So, what the hell? Okay. <laughs> Some ogres just walked out of nowhere. Or, I mean, trolls just walked out of nowhere. They have no idea what they want, but whatever. Clear the rest of the map. I actually missed some of the map up here, but yeah, there's nothing there. Okay, go that way. And then you can go this way, I guess. Actually, take all this stuff back. Yes, that is mine. And that is mine, and that's gonna be mine. And Oops. Ooh, Ballista. Hmm. We're gonna have to talk to them, get them on our team. Ballista would be really handy to defend this town right here. Very, very handy. Uh, he's already going that way. He's already going that way. And that guy's going that way. I don't really need these other Zephyr birds at all. Honestly. Honestly, that's all already... Hmm. Guess we'll just send him back up the way I came over... Right there. That'll work. Who is this? Meander is down here. Interesting. Okay, just head back up that direction. Get away from him. So yeah, Meander's coming down here. He thinks he's got some. We're gonna attack him. We're gonna get him out of our area. That's what we're gonna do. Yes, yes. Very good. I can't attack him yet. We'll attack him next turn. Uh, let's see. You guys are guarding for now until I can get those ballista. You are exploring still. Keep exploring. Good, good. 
Those guys have been more or less useless as far as the war effort goes, but that's okay. Uh, defending, defending. Okay, that's everyone. Haste domain, casting special stuff. Okay, good, good. Go to the underground, because right off the bat, I'm going to attack Meander. I'm going to destroy your little unit of pitiful unit guys. You're going to die. Oh, he's got a Butcher. Butcher is one of the few uh, good goblin units. Honestly, for its tier, it's actually pretty damn good, but the rest of them are more or less crap. So... I think it's tier one if I remember right. I do believe, let's see. Uh, cosmic garbage. Everyone wants to be a spellcaster. It's tier two. Butcher is tier two. So yeah, for tier two units, Butcher's actually really good. But the rest of the goblin units are kinda blah. Let's see, what all did you give me? Okay, she's cursed. He's paralyzed. And he has vertigo. <laughs> Damn it, Cosmic Spray. Ugh. Shooting him would be a waste because he's got block. I'm pretty sure. Why, he doesn't have block? Yet another unit with a shield that does not have block. That is weird. Okay, so screw it. Go ahead and shoot him in the face. Well, you hit him once. That's something. You can go ahead and fight this little crag beetle guy. And not kill him because you suck. Uh, shoot the butcher, please. Okay. Apparently no one can kill anyone. This is pathetic. You guys really suck. Just want you to know that. That's a hero, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And he has spell casting. He's gonna die, so I'm not really worried. He's caused fear, too. You little bastard. You little bastard. He has caused fear. Okay. Alright, sneak up on this bastard and murder him, please. No, don't go that way. Go this way. Ow. There we go. Yeah, see, like I said, the butchers, they're pretty damn tough for tier 2. He's stunned, so I can't use him. I've used all your turns. You haven't done anything yet. You've got spell casting points, so... Stone the hell out of this bastard. He's probably going to be the toughest target. That'll work. And then I will stone him as well. Goodbye! <laughs> too bad for you. Stone's too strong. Okay, I think that's everyone. Yeah. We're just gonna have to let the cards fall where they may. Probably, wow, they didn't even kill the archer. <laughs> didn't even kill the archer. Okay, you can go ahead and shoot him. And I think we're going to show off round attack, actually. No, it won't work. They're too spread out. Uh, round attack, let's say this guy was right here. I can move him between them, use round attack, and I'd hit them both at once, which is pretty cool. Sadly, no dice. You can't attack, because you will die. You have two health, and you're cursed. So that sucks. You can move up, shoot some archery off at this guy. That's fine. Uh, you do not need to be leveled. Uh, any XP on a summoned unit is usually useless. They're probably going to die. They're meant to be cannon fodder. So we're going to use... We're going to use you to kill this guy. There we go. Get some charioteer EXP. And we're going to use you to kill this guy. Hopefully. Or you can miss horribly. There we go. Okay. So we got some EXP for our warlord and our charioteer. And this stupid troll wants to attack our Zephyr bird. You stupid, stupid troll. Whatever. Fine. So be it. You can have it. Damn troll. Okay, we'll take this one that's higher up and we'll circle him around the troll. We're still gonna go north, but we're gonna go around him. Go a little more circuitous route than I was planning. Actually, it looks like that's it for down here. Is that Meander too? It is. He has two warlords right there. Interesting. I could take them on. I've still got plenty of casting points. And they don't have good resists, if I remember right. Yeah, they have terrible resists. I could take them on, actually, so I think I'm going to do that. I think we'll fight the warlords. 
Bring it on, friendos. The key to fighting warlords is basically not grouping up, not letting them get their round attack off. Let's see, okay. You need to move... Actually, you need to get the hell out of the fight, period. Just leave. Just straight up go away. <laughs> uh, you need to move back. That'll be fine right there. Do you have... Yes, you do. You have a cast left. Okay, move back a couple of spaces. And then cast. Uh, you can cast stoning on the guy in the front. Okay, look at that. I did half his health. That's these guys' one big weakness. The resistance is just kind of terrible. Everything else about them is beast. But their resistance is kind of blah. You need to stand in front of her so they can't get to her. Because that would be bad. Uh, can you move back a little bit and still shoot? Probably. Yeah, okay. Ugh, oh, that defense. Jesus. Okay, move back. Shoot him. Good, good. Oh, that defense! There's, there's no way I'm gonna get a shot off. They, they just have too much defense. Move back up one. And he's still cursed to make it even worse. Yeah, I'm not gonna even get a single shot off. Okay. We're gonna use our spell power to do stoning as well. And he is almost dead. If we hadn't missed two of our shots there, he would be dead. But that's okay. He's going to get one attack off and miss. That's fine. Okay, I think what we're going to do is... You're going to get the hell out of the fight, because you're important, and I don't want you to die. Uh, you guys... Okay, you need to get the hell back up here. Stand right there. That way he'll waste his turns on this Minotaur. That's what I want him to do at this point. He can't run because he'll take a hit and very likely lose 90% of his health, so we're just gonna shoot. See what happens. Mm, didn't kill him, okay. Can you finish this guy off? Actually, round attack. Yeah, round attack. Okay, now you'll get to see it. There's one here and one here and they'll both get hit. Oh, I hit my archer too. <laughs> Oops. Oh, well, you gotta see round attack. It's really cool. Okay, so he's just chilling. Let's go ahead and shoot him with some arrows. Why is he in the way? Okay, move back one. He's still in the way. That doesn't make any sense at all. He shouldn't be in the way. What about you? Okay, you've got a clean shot. That's really weird. Okay, what we're gonna do is you're gonna move there. Probably blocked. Yeah, okay. You're gonna move there. You should finally have a clean shot. There we go. Okay, whiff hard. Now we'll move him back where he was, and he should have a clean shot again. There we go. Hey, you even got a hit off. Okay, we haven't used our spell yet, so we're gonna stone him. Ooh, he's got like one health. Yeah, he has one health. If anyone hits him with anything, he's dead. So let's go ahead and see if you can murder him. Oh, you don't have any attack. Okay. Alright, that's fine. Oh, bad idea, friend. Bad idea. He decided to uh, to not fight the Minotaur or the Warlord. He wanted to move past them. But when you uh, when you move out of combat, if you're locked into combat with someone and you try to move away, you take a hit on, in the process. Uh, like in D&D, it's called uh, Attack of Opportunity. It's basically the same idea here. And uh, he got himself killed trying to move away. Bad idea. That was a mistake. So yeah, these guys have done really, really well. This particular group. Let's see, that's all cleared. I think we need to get out of the underground with these guys. I don't know, maybe we should just go attack Meander some more. No, no, think about it. Like, take that town and keep going that way. First, we're going to hit up this healing uh, building thing. What is it called? I've already forgotten. Healing church or something like that. We're going to go over there first, and then we'll circle back around this way. And she got a really crappy level. Awesome. No spell casting. No, I'm not that lucky. I get... At least I got attack. That's something. If I have to go into combat with her, attack rating is the best stat to have, but I would have rather had spell casting. Or a ranged attack. I don't think... Oh, she does... Okay, she has poison darts. So yeah, I don't need a ranged attack, but I'd rather have spell casting. But, oh well, 
I will take attack rating. It's fine. Is that actually cute right now? Yeah, okay, good. Uh, sanctuary. Good, good. Just keep building stuff. Uh, no. Do you have walls? You have walls. Okay. I just need to migrate that town. I don't care about anything else. Okay, you got down migrating. Good, good. You guys are defenders, and you need to go that way. Go on over there. You need to build stuffages. Build a wall, I guess. Uh, what are you... You're building a builder's hall. Okay, build a monastery as well. Uh... Yeah, builder's hall. Monastery. What are you doing? Builder's hall. <laughs> War hall, that'll work. Just keep the buildings flowing, please. Keep the upgrades going. Uh, ooh, I can build some giant warriors. That's tempting right there. They're a pretty beast. I think for now we're just gonna keep upgrading. Focus on getting these towns finished. Uh, you need to take that and then talk to these guys because they are friendos. Yes, friendos. Very good. And then you're gonna explore that way. There's apparently no one over here for the moment, so that's good. Uh, you, yeah, you're going this way. You are going... Is there anything over here? Oh, there is. Go that way. Oh, <laughs> never mind. No, there's not. Looked like there was, but there's not. Okay. I'm sure that this path is going to split at some point, so I'll send them both that way. Eventually, it'll split. Uh, okay. Ballista go there. Yes. Good, good. And then... You guys need to stay there in case they try to revolt, at least until the Ballista get there. You can join these guys, because why not? We'll uh, team them up. That should be helpful. I've got a space left in that party. Uh, you're a guard, so just guard. You can move. Why didn't you... Okay, whatever. Right, yeah, you were going to talk to these guys. Okay, friendos. Yes, good, good. And then just keep exploring this wall right here. See where it goes. Apparently nowhere as of yet. There's something right here. I don't know what it is. Don't know what it is yet, but we will investigate further. Just keep following this wall. Looks like there's nothing over here either. Okay, uh, sit on that. You join them. Are they happy? No, they're not. They're pissed. Okay. Who are you pissed off at this time? It's gotta be these two guys. Just join them. Yeah, see, they're perfectly fine. But, no, Archons are douchebags. They rage. <laughs> they just constantly rage at everyone. They're not happy. They're not a happy people. Which, you think that they were very good, or because they're very good, that they'd be, you know, fucking copacetic. But no. No, they hate everyone. <laughs> they hate everyone. Let's see. Uh, okay, I need you to group up with these guys. Yes, do that. They will be my main attacking force against Meander. Eventually, when I get to that point. Are you ever going to get to this damn town? Okay, next turn. Alright. Taking forever. Uh, you're a guard, so guard. You, yeah, take that. And that. And anything else I can find. There's something up there. Something down here. I think we'll circle around this way. We'll get some scouting in and we'll take some buildings at the same time. So you head over to this town and be generally unfriendly. Actually, let's take that right there and I'll think about it. Yeah, you've already moved. You're guarding, so... Did I tell them to build a wall? Because they need a wall. Yes, you need a wall. Build a wall. No town is complete without a wall. 
That's just a fact. Is that everyone? Okay, is this building anything? Yeah, ballista, right. Okay. Alright, good, good. So that turn is more or less done. I've got haste domain almost cast. Very good. I don't think I really need to worry about anyone either. Because I didn't see anyone in range of a threat. So, should be good to pass the turn. Ballista, yeah, good. Oh, okay, what the hell happened here? Oh, they revolted, my Dark Elf town down here revolted for some reason. Weird. That is strange. I'm not sure why. Uh, you can have those two. Whatever. <laughs> It's fine. Does not bother me. Let's see what our relations are like. Okay, that's really weird. Huh. What the hell? Okay, so everyone is friendly, it looks like. Or at least, pretty much everyone is friendly. What are you? Okay, you're polite. Polite means they're not gonna revolt. You're polite. Frostlings have to be polite. Yeah, okay. Elves are probably, yeah, polite. Okay, so everyone is fucking polite. Why are they revolting? Uh, dwarves. Yeah, everyone is polite. This is ridiculous. Oh, Archons are neutral. Rome consists primarily of the races of Darkness and Twilight. It's true. I don't have a lot of good units. It's mainly because good units are kind of crap in this game. Honestly. The, uh, the good races, uh, elves, dwarves, halflings, and sirons, as a whole, don't have that many good units. Each one of those races has maybe one or two good units, whereas the neutral races, for the most part, have just 100% wall-to-wall good units. Like, nomads have almost all good units, uh, draconians have almost all good units, tigrans have a lot of good units, so there's a big discrepancy there. And the evil races have better units than the good races, so... I just don't tend to use a lot of good units. In fact, I think the only ones off the top of my head that I can even think of that I would want to use are like... Ugh, like maybe the Sheriff from Halfling is really good. He's a good unit. The Giant Warriors from the Sirens, obviously, those are good. There's just not a lot of them, honestly. Oh, the, the Iron Maiden from Elves. I've been using her a lot. She's a good unit. But yeah, there's just not that many, honestly. But Neutral's fine. That means they shouldn't revolt. What about the Dark Elves? The Dark Elves are polite and they're revolting? Why? What the hell? That makes no sense at all. Polite. Goblins. Polite. Undead might be neutral. Yeah, undead are neutral. Okay. Why in Twilight? That's not true at all. I don't have that many light units. I mean, other than like my Iron Maidens, I don't have any, I don't think. Whatever. Okay, so the only ones that aren't happy are Undead and Archons, which makes sense. Archons are very good, and Undead are very evil. They're like the far ends of the spectrum. They're the only races that are very good or very evil. The rest of them are in the middle. So it makes sense that they wouldn't be happy, but why the hell did the Dark Elves revolt? That makes no sense. I'm very confused. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't really care. Like I said, I don't care about that town at all. But it's just strange. It makes no sense. Does not compute. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Cast. Yes. He's domain. Good, good. Now everyone in my domain, which uh, my domain is the the circle, this little red line right here. Anyone within one of my circles like that gets haste permanently. So these guys should have haste. It's because they're in the town that they don't have it. It's really weird. I don't know why they don't have it. They should have it. Hmm. I don't know. I did just cast it, right? I don't know. I'm going to have to figure that out. <laughs> they should have haste, because they're inside my domain. Uh, you were building nothing for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, this is my main town. It needs some defenses, honestly. Build some ballista. Build a lot of ballista. In case someone decides to roll up and try to take my town. That'd be bad. Uh, no, I don't need a wizard tower. What do you have left to build? Ooh, do I have red dragons? 
I have red dragons. I have red dragons. Give me red dragons. Yes. Give me lots and lots of red dragons. Lots and lots and lots. Red dragons are beasts. Uh, they're the draconian ultimate unit. They are strong. They are strong. Looks like I'm two buildings away from having Sphinx as well. Which is really cool. Very, very happy about that. They took that back. Okay, whatever. I don't care. You can have it. You are circling around and going to the north. Assuming there's no other, like, trolls and shit trying to attack me. There's a butcher, but he is a ground unit, and I am a flying unit, so he cannot touch me. He is completely useless in this particular scenario. Okay, you need to go that way. You need to get on the town. Yeah, get over there. Good, good. Uh, you guys can group up. And then start exploring over here. This one will be my exploring unit, and this one will be my attacking unit. He'll follow behind and take things over. Or at least that's the plan. Let's see. Keep exploring. Take it a little bit at a time in case we run into anything. Not seeing anything yet. Nope. Uh, you, yes. Go over there. And... We'll go ahead and migrate this to dwarves. And then we can give them their town back. Let's see. Dwarves, dwarves. There we go. So let's see. Dwarves are migrated. The Shadow Demon's finished. The goblins should be migrated somewhere, right? Did I start the goblin migration yet? It's hard to keep track of all this crap. I don't think I did. Okay, we'll start them up there. Actually, yeah, right now. There we go. We'll do the goblins right here. Dun, dun, dun. Yes, okay. So we got goblins and dwarves. Those are the only two left, if I remember right. Let's give it a quick once over. Archon elves, dwarves, halflings, Siron, human tigrin, draconian, frostling, nomad, goblin, orc, dark elf. Yeah, that's it. Those are the only two left that I hadn't migrated. So I officially have all the towns, or all the races, which is good stuff. Good, good stuff. That was definitely the plan. Uh, you guys are guards, so do the guardings. You were going to take his, what is this, an air node? Yeah. Take the air node from him. And... What is that? Marketplace. I don't care about the marketplace. I do not need any siege engines at the moment. Thank you, though. Uh, let's find out what this is. Oh, it's a furnace. Okay. Perseus has it, so I'm not going to take it from him. I would start a war. I don't want to start a war with him yet. After I kill Meander, I'll probably start a war with Perseus. Or Tempest, or both of them. Something like that. A haste tree. Okay. That's good. We will use that next turn. Doodly-doo. Doodly -doo. Let's see, that's this entire left side of the wall done. I can't explore that. Because, actually, give me a Zephyr Bird. Okay, we'll cast that next right there, and then he can explore that for us. And we'll have this entire area cleared. <laughs> Everything. Uh, What the hell? Okay, so that's where that party went. Alright. That is one tough party. That is one tough party. I could attack them, but it's probably not a good idea. What is this? That's a lot of units. Holy crap. Maybe I should move over here and invite these guys and have them attack them. Although they'll probably die too, honestly. Screw it. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I'm feeling frisky. 1200, huh? Okay. Alright, just attack these guys. Oh, wait a minute, no, no, no. Retreat for now. Let's see if these guys can get in range. Looks like they can get in range. Okay. Just stand on top of these. Oh, won't let me? Okay. Move over there. Yeah, okay. Attack him. No, no, no. Oh, I'm out of range. 
I thought I was surrounding him, but apparently not. Okay, move there. Now attack. No? Okay. You attack. There we go. There we go, okay. So we've got three different parties surrounding this one group of enemies. As you can see. We'll see what happens. <laughs> I'm curious, because they've got a lot of strong units. While wow, you hit no one. <laughs> you literally missed with every single shot. That's amazing. One-shotted! Holy crap, he must have had no health. Bone Horrors are going after my charioteers. The Warlords are splitting up. What is this hero doing? He must have cast that turn. Yeah, he cast. Okay. He's going to try and trap someone. That's a badass skill to have on a hero right there. My uh, slavers that I used at the beginning of this Let's Play, they have that ability. We gotta kill that guy before he traps someone. That'd be bad. Okay, move up one. Actually, move up two, so you're not in the knight's way. Throw some poison darts at his back. Hit him for one damage. Awesome. We use the knight. Knights have crazy defense. Yeah, he can't even hit him. <laughs> he can't even hit him. Okay, you move up one and attack this guy. Finish him off. There we go. Good, good. You need to move over this way and at the very least get in the way so they're not all attacking my charioteers. That'd be bad. Uh, you do the same. Go over that way. Just get in get in that area, please. <laughs> that would be good. You were going to attack this hero over here. My little flying wyvern rider guy. Or sorry, ice drake rider. He doesn't even get cold strike. Well, that sucks. I could have sworn he, he had a uh, cold strike. This guy right here is trying to get close enough to explode. We're going to kill him before he can do that, hopefully. There we go. No explosion for you. And we're just going to swarm the hell out of this warlord. From every direction, basically. Oh, great. He got a hit in. Didn't think I'd moved that far, but that's okay. Move around. Yes. No... Wow, okay. It's not even letting me move around him, but that's fine. These guys are basically cannon fodder anyways, so... Go ahead and move up. And... There we go. Attack. Attack. Yeah, it's like a swarm of bees, <laughs> basically. He's completely out of action points. He can't even attack. Uh, can you get behind him? Oh, that'll work. My knight might be able to finish him off. Oh, he doesn't have enough action points. Okay. So, yeah, we're swarming the hell out of this warlord, just raping his action points. You guys need to move the hell back, assuming I actually want you to be alive at the end of this fucking fight. I don't know, maybe Holy Strike will be enough. Oh, they don't have Holy Strike. I think they get it when they upgrade, if I remember right. Uh, okay, just move back a little bit. Get, get back away from them and then shoot for now. Probably gonna whiff every shot. Yeah, that's fine. Archery. Well, you did two damage. It's good, I guess. Okay. Uh, we should be able to cast. I think we'll cast... Stoning. Oh, I don't have a hero here? Three groups of units, and I don't have one hero. <laughs> okay, fine. Whatever. Elephant Rider versus Warlord. Wow, it's actually pretty even so far. Go, go, Elephant Rider! Aww. He did pretty good. Get him. Stick him! Stab his ass! <laughs> his Warlord is still not dead, sadly. Uh, I think we'll What are your stats? 13 defense. Wow. That's surprising. Uh, we're going to use the knight to kill the warlord. Just so none of these other guys die. There we go. And then you guys can surround this asshole. Or at the very least, that's the plan. There we go. <laughs> this guy is so screwed. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, you need to finish... Well, you can't move away without taking a hit, though. I don't care. Oh, it didn't attack. That's weird. There we go. No more warlords. That's good. 
Uh, first of all, you move there. Attack him. Damn, Bone Horse hit hard. Bone Horse do not play around. Get him, Mr. Knight. Or not. It's fine. Uh, you guys need to harass this guy. The two of you together should be able to take him, I would think. Maybe. Maybe not. Wow, he went gold rank. He went gold rank and just did 17 damage in one hit. Oh my god. Wow. That's a lot of damage. He must have gotten maximum hit roll, or maximum damage roll, and then maximum death strike at the same time, because that's a lot of damage. Okay, let's see if we can kill this guy. Use all of your attacks. Every single one of them. Eventually, he'll run out of action points. There we go. Looks like you need to move there. And then you can attack him. And whiff horribly. What is his health at? Wow, he's barely even damaged. That guy's tough. He's not playing around. Luckily, I still have my three knights left. So, I should be fine. Uh, use the cannon fodder first. And they all missed. <laughs> and he got frozen too. Awesome. And everyone is missing. Can you attack him, please? Yes, attack him. Ugh, he's still not even damaged. This is ridiculous. That guy is really, really strong. Okay, knight, finish him off, please. He's still not dead. Okay. There we go. And you can finish this guy. Okay, good. Now we just have the hero left. These two are frozen. This one's burned, and that one's frozen. Holy crap. Okay, waste his action points. Good. You can't attack. You can't attack. Everyone is fucking frozen. Waste the rest of his action points. Please, thank you. Good. There we go. So my knight got burned <laughs> near the end, but we finally beat them. Jeez. That was one tough group of units right there. They were not playing around. Uh, just get on the town for now. Yeah, that was... That, that fucking group of units was not playing around. That that hero was really strong. Uh, the two bone horrors were strong. It, what the fuck, dude? The warlords were strong. There was a lot of good units. All in one fight. Uh, go and head up that direction. Hopefully he will get there eventually. Yeah, you can group up with them. Whenever they get done enforcing migration, we'll send them back up here somewhere. Let's see. Yeah, migration. Back around. Have not moved you yet. You need to talk to these guys. I don't care about the herbalists. The herbalists can just do whatever they're doing. I think that's everyone. Okay, so that'll be it for uh, this particular video. <laughs> Next video, we'll finish, you know, grabbing up the spoils of war. I think there's, what, three more towns to grab over here? Uh, we'll keep attacking Meander. We've attacked him a little bit. We killed his unit in the underground and took some of his structures, but we're going to keep edging our way to the northwest-ish area. And uh, also in the underground down here. We're just going to keep invading his area with everything we have until he has nothing left. <laughs> War of attrition style, basically. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Uh, we'll just keep him money. I've got tons of money. Have a bunch of money. Let's see. It's not moving very quickly. There we go. There's whatever that is. Are you happy now? There, he's happy. Okay, good. Don't burn down the town, please. Jesus. Ugh. It's got the little burning down animation, but it's not being raised. It's weird. I don't know. I don't care. Just build a unit to sit on the town for now, because I need this town. I forgot to migrate dwarves, because I'm retarded. I have brain damage, apparently. Let's see, what else did I forget? Halfling Sauron. There's halflings right there, and there's Sauron's right there. 
Human I obviously have, Tigran, Draconian, Frostling, Nomad, I have all those. Goblin I just got last video for free. Orc, Dark Elf, I have Dark Elf down here somewhere, right? They should be migrating. Shadow Demons. Undead, Dark Elf, where is it? Okay, Undead's right here. Yeah, and Dark Elf, maybe Dark Elf's up here. Yeah, okay. Alright, so Dwarf was the only thing that I didn't have. <clears throat> Apparently. And the only ones I need to migrate are Dwarf and Goblin, I think. Right? Everything else is in my area, I believe. Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay, so the only ones I need to migrate are Dwarf and Goblin. So let's say that's Dwarf or Goblin right there, and then that can be the other one. So why do I have this sound over here? Why... I have no idea why I built that one. I, I counted wrong, I guess. I'll have an extra town, I suppose. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, you guys, what are you guys doing? You're... Okay, you're enforcing migration. Next turn, they can move over there. And we can migrate someone. Do I, do I have anyone headed this way at all? No. Okay, you guys go that way. Please. Good sirs, go that way. Good, good. Okay, so I should have migration handled. Uh, why am I casting a Minotaur? I've already beaten Arctica. I don't need a Minotaur. I need haste domain. That's what I need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that. Do that. Do not need a Minotaur. Uh, yes. I got Labdabur. I'll give it back to him again. This will be the second time I've... We have elves. Uh, do we have dwarves? Pretty sure we have dwarves somewhere, right? What is this town? That's not even ours anymore. We gave that away, that's right. Okay. What is this? This is humans, I think. Yeah, okay. Humans. Tigran. Did we not migrate dwarves? Am I that retarded? Oh my god. We didn't migrate dwarves. I had a dwarf town from like the start of the game, but I never migrated them. I forgot, I guess. Ugh, that is exceptionally stupid. Okay, so we need to take the town back. It was way over here somewhere. What the hell? Someone's burning down the dwarf town. Why? Why are you burning down the dwarf town? Don't... Don't burn down the dwarf town. I want it back. Can I buy it back? Please do not burn it down. I have no idea if there's another one. It's called Lab Dubar. Oh, I can't. Okay, give me the town back. Won't be happy. Okay, fine. I'll make him happy. Just don't burn down the damn town, please. Bought it and giving it back to them, but uh, I need to migrate the dwarves. I forgot. I forgot to migrate the dwarves, sadly. Where the hell is this? Who owns this town? Nobody. It's independent. Okay, we'll go buy it, I guess. What is that? First of all, let's investigate over here. Oh, there's a free item just lying on the ground. What is it? Pixie Dust? <laughs> uh, Pixie Dust is like Cosmic Spray. It's just a random debuff. You can use it in battle and it'll give them like Burn or Poison or Curse or Vertigo or some random negative debuff. Not the best item in the world, but oh well. We'll talk to them next turn. Buy out their town from them. You need to go... Right there, actually. Take that from him. Yes. Give me that. And then take that. And then take that. And then probably take some other stuff. <sighs> you are my pillaging bird of prey. Stealing all their stuffages. Uh, you guys can actually join me for all I care. Is that an elephant rider? I think it is. Yeah, okay. Group up. Alright, hello people. I'm the dude and this is Let's Play Age of Wonders. Let's load her up. As you'll probably remember, we destroyed Arctica. She is gone for good. She has no chance to come back. Arctica is done like Din Din. 
So let's see. We're probably going to just pillage her area a bit, since there's so many towns that are uh, free now, that aren't controlled by anyone, and so many groups of enemies that are basically just wandering, like that one right there. We could probably get them on our team if we talk to them. Yeah, see? And we'll take over her structures and stuff like that. We'll make uh, plans to take out Meander. First, I need to figure out what I need to migrate. What is left to migrate? That is priority number one. Okay, we got a free Frostling Town right there, so that's done. Actually, let's get my list of races now that I think about it. Let's see. Okay, Archons. We definitely have Archons. We've been building Charioteers. They're right there.